Good morning guys, so the plan for today is to make more fly screen and while Aaron will do that I will clean the pantry because a mouse went inside and it's a bit disgusting but before that I need to package some soaps for a wholesale order that I got from a local farm I'm very excited for it um, if you guys don't know, I make homemade soap and lotions and candles and bath salts and other body care products. This is kind of my hobby while we're not traveling. So if you guys are interested, I will leave the link to my Etsy store down below. These are the soap and I added also a little gift for the owner, Amanda, who is lovely, um, coconut cream, so a body lotion, and a vanilla lip balm, I'll show you. I love this lotion, I always use it. And yeah, it's so pretty, isn't it? I'm so proud of it. And here we have Iron. Yeah. And in the window frame. Good morning. And... The dog annoy him. She's upset because I took her to work. Oh, why? I'm squeaking. <laughs> I'm squeaking constantly. Hang on, I'll get it back. Watch this. <laughs> okay, so you want to explain a little bit what you are doing? I'm making the more uh, mosquito net. Window frames for the bus. Yeah. Oh, hello. Uh, we did a trial run of the mosquito nets. There we go. For the last video. Uh, if you didn't see that or if you want to know how to make mosquito nets or mosquito, what are they called? Mosquito screens? Insect screens. If you want to know how to make insect screens for your bus or your motorhome, uh, check out our last video because we did a trial run of that. Uh, so I'm just putting more up there. This video is going to be super squeaky. Hey you, shut up. Okay, I left Aaron to do his fly screen and I'm going to clean the pantry. Now I will show you why. So the guy who built the bus built this thing uh, all around the bus. But it's empty inside so there is no insulation. And it gets all behind the kitchen to the pantry. So inside this there is a hole for all the wires and the steam pipe that goes from the inside here to the ground. And the pantry down there was open. You can see the difference in the wood. Aaron closed it just the other day. Uh, yeah, it was open all the way to the sink, so it was very easy for us to come inside. And yeah, now it's clean time. So this is actually the second time that this happens. Uh, I'm getting a bit tired of cleaning the pantry. The little bus that I ate my protein pizza base. My very expensive protein pizza base. Now I have to throw it away. Yes? It's lunchtime. <laughs> lunchtime. <laughs> have some lunch. There you go, that's better. Bubby? Bubby? It's lunchtime. Oh, oh no, she doesn't want the camera. Hey, Bubba dogs? I reckon let's have some lunch. Poor oh, puppy. Puppy wants bones for lunch. I think she wants to just go her toy. She wants bones. So what's for lunch? Mouse. Why? 
Yesterday I cleaned the, the top of the pantry <laughs> and was all nice and clean so today I was going uh, the other part of the pantry and the bastard came in and he ate my muesli and I I don't understand how he got in. So what you're saying it's is closed. what you're saying is you're outsmarted by a mouse. Yes. I'm only you because you closed in the pantry. <laughs> I can't believe it. That thing is to die. That's the face of frustration. Yes. So what's for lunch? Protein shake. Mmm. Shake. It's it's mine. The big one's mine. Yes. It's my shake. Because we are lazy and we don't feel like cooking anything else. So, vegan protein. Mmm. I a spoon. <laughs> she doesn't like the camera. Poor oh, puppy. Okay, Aaron is trying to close the last two holes, literally this big at the bottom of the pantry, and hopefully that will work. We actually don't know where the sounds are coming in because there is no space. <laughs> so. We assume that it might be the honey hole underneath, or yeah, there's the last chance. Hopefully, it will work. All right, so there's a little gap in the wood there, and uh, over here as well. So we suspect the mouse is still getting through there. So I've got bits of wood here that I'm going to glue in place and stop it. And that should fix him. If he's not getting through there, if he's getting through somewhere else, we don't know where he's getting through. He must be a magic mouse and he must be able to walk through walls. <laughs> Ghost mouse. He's Houdini reincarnated. <laughs> Alright, I cleaned the pantry. Again. <laughs> For like the fourth time. Uh, let's go see uh, what, what he's up to. How is it going? Good. Good. It's a bit windy. Yeah. I need an extra three. Oh wow, you need three. Uh-huh. Cool. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Oh, look at that. Finally. You're welcome. Good Hi. job. You're welcome. Alright, I am putting the light screen in here. Like you probably can't see because it's too bright. Okay, that's better. And I'm going to remove the other hose, the old one. Thanks. <laughs> and also I'm going to follow some clothes because it's a mess in here. So someone fucked up. I wouldn't call it a fuck up. It's just a miscalculation. So these are the screws from outside right. the bus. Now they're inside the bus. Yes. And now there's a hole in the bus. Yeah, but it's fine. Water can't get in. Where is it? I can't see it through the camera. Oh, yeah. It's fine. I'll fix it later. No. You say you fix it later, you will fix it like next year. <laughs> yeah. Alright, so we have four flat screen done, seven to go. Now we are going to Bandung's to buy. One of the gas battle because uh, we're out of gas in the house and it's getting quite cold to have a cold shower and then we're going to buy more frame and um, the mesh, how is it called mesh? Uh, screen mesh? Mesh? Mesh screen? Anyway uh, and yeah whatever we need to do more fly screen So last night we came back home quite late from Bunnings and uh, we kind of abandoned the vlog because we were so tired. After that we cleaned all the pantry and the fly screens. So today is the day after and I have to tell you that the mouse is back. After that, after that we closed all the pantry 
again. So yeah, we name uh, we decide we will keep it and we will name it Houdini. No, we are not really going to keep it, but yes, we name him we name him Houdini, and Houdini needs to go. I don't know how. So we transfer all our food inside the oven, put the tops inside the pantry, <laughs> and hopefully sooner or later it will die. And that's it for today, for this vlog. Uh, we will see you next time. We will update you on uh, who did it and if it's gone or if it's still eating our food. Like, subscribe and leave us a comment. And please, if you know how to catch a mouse, let us know. <laughs> Bye guys. Ciao for now.